Dallas, United States, April 27, 2023. American company Lockheed Martin has been awarded a $4.79 billion contract by the U.S. Army for the production of two full-rate lots of guided multiple launch rocket system, GMLRS, rockets and related equipment. The deal includes the manufacturing of GMLRS unitary and alternative warhead, AW, rockets, as well as integrated logistics support for both the U.S. Army and international partners. Jay Price, Vice President of Precision Fires for Lockheed Martin Missiles and Fire Control, emphasized the close collaboration with the Army and supply chain partners to rapidly increase production capacity in response to the high demand for this reliable, battle-tested rocket. The guided multiple launch rocket system, GMLRS, is a surface-to-surface -surface system designed for attacking, neutralizing, suppressing, and destroying targets using precise indirect fire at ranges up to 70 kilometers or more. GMLRS munitions offer increased accuracy compared to traditional ballistic rockets, resulting in a higher likelihood of target destruction and a reduced logistics footprint. The current GMLRS munition family includes three fielded variants, the dual-purpose improved conventional munition, DPICM, an alternative warhead, AW, for area targets, and the unitary variant equipped with a single 200-pound class high explosive charge for point targets, minimizing collateral damage. The GMLRS is compatible with the M270 MLRS, multiple launch rocket system, and M142 HIMARS high mobility artillery rocket system launchers. Price highlighted the growing demand for GMLRS rockets due to their strategic advantage, unparalleled accuracy, and cost effectiveness, making them suitable for various missions. Production will take place at Lockheed Martin facilities in Camden, Arkansas, Dallas and Lufkin, Texas, Archbold, Pennsylvania, and Orlando, Florida. The project is expected to be completed by 2026.